Here's the top 25 in terms of recruiting rankings according to 247 for the class of 2023. And granted, there's still like a month, a little over a month till the early signing period. So, Alabama number one, Georgia two, Notre Dame three, LSU four, Ohio State five, Texas six, Oklahoma seven, Miami, Florida eight, Flo Florida nine, Clemson ten, Oregon eleven. Tennessee 12, USC 13, Penn State 14, South Carolina 15, Arkansas 16, Texas A&M 17, Louisville 18, Florida State 19, North Carolina 20, Baylor 21, Texas Tech 22, TCU 23, Michigan 24, Cincinnati number 25. But like... Ole Miss is number 26, Washington is number 27, Northwestern 28, Stanford 29, and Iowa 30. That's just to name some teams by past on the outside looking in. West Virginia is number 31, Nebraska 32, Iowa, Kansas State 33, Iowa State 34, Duke 35. But i tell you one thing about Iowa State. They need to find a an offense. <laughs> but granted, it's a first-year quarterback. I mean... And for all we know, these rankings could be changed significantly because, you know, head coaching changes do happen. So, I mean, for example, West Virginia could, they, they probably, their coach is probably going to be gone down to, sooner or later. I would say Louisville's coach, it depends on how they do the rest of the year. I mean, it's the truth. I know they're having a winning record right now. I'm going to just check on their record officially. Real fast. I know they just beat somebody, I mean, beat Wake Forest pretty good. So, you know, they're 5-3 and three right now. The remaining games are James Madison at home. They should win that one. Should. But Clemson on the road, oof, that's tough. NC State at home. But the thing is, NC State's without their quarterback for the rest of the year. That's a winnable game. At Kentucky, that's, that could be... It's a rivalry game, so anything could happen. So possibly, maybe I see at max nine wins in the regular season before the bowl game. But I for sure see James Madison right now as a win. And NC State as a win. I'm not sure about the other... Actually, that's... Eight games, actually, because yeah, if you could beat technically Kentucky, NC State, and James Madison, that's eight wins right there. Never mind, not nine wins. But still, that's potential. But that's including being Kentucky. <coughs> Excuse me, I just know Kentucky on a, is a good team. Wow, so you know. We'll have to just wait and see on what happens in the coaching carousel as well. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. That's going to be the point of subscribers and more by the end of this year. I just was curious to see what the rankings are. I knew there was not going to be that much of change. These are according to 247. And not the composite either. It's overall. As in like the number of points on each column. I mean, for each team. So, that's all.